it is time for a very special buzz with your cuss. And we're gonna need these. Well, it's great to see everyone. As you can tell here again, it's a very special episode of Buzz With Your Cuz. See? You remember uh, years ago when your favorite sitcom, they came on and like, welcome to a very special episode. And then they talk about some serious topic you had absolutely no interest in. I'm tuning in to have a good time and now you're taking me down some serious topic that I don't really care about. And that's not happening today. Uh, first of all, uh, we have a very, very special product, so I'm glad you tuned in. Make sure you hit the thumbs up, comment below. Okay, this particular bottle was recommended to us by one of our very dear friends and his mom, who uh, wanted to see what we thought about the Sassanac. <laughs> Release the Kraken! <laughs> or uh, bring on the Sassanac. A uh, really nice box. We haven't even opened this yet. So this is going to be an unboxing, an unbottling of sorts, um, if you will. So uh, Sassanac, we learned, is a Scottish Gaelic term that means uh, outsider, stranger. So this was uh, actually made by an outlander. This is owned and uh, collaborated with uh, Sam Hewen from Outlanders. A really super popular show. People keep confusing us for some reason. I don't know why. That's kind of why I started growing this beard in a little bit. It gets a little tiresome, like, you know, him calling going, people are yelling buzz with your cuz at me all day. And the same thing, people are asking me, what happened on the Outlanders? The answer is, I don't know. So, with that said, Sam Hewen, he's got this uh, Scotch whiskey. Uh, you know, again, you know, Scottish, great. Uh, it's a collaboration with uh, Michael Henry, so he's the, the guy who blended this in hopefully wonderful product. And uh, he's of the Le Mans Distillery in Scotland. So, uh, single malt. Let's let's get this thing open. Let's take a look at the bottles here. Oh, look at that. Beautiful. It's a really nice bottle here. It's branded well. It says no color added. So they must have taken all those gold medals that they won in. It's in here. All kidding aside, there are a bunch of medals that they've won on here, and uh, I hear that they continue to win them. So 20, 2020, basically, to 2022, International Spirits Challenge, gold, gold, gold. World Spirits Competition, 2020, 2021, 2022, double gold. Double gold, wow. Uh, and then there's a couple of other ones, New York Wine and Spirits, the Spirits Business, Definitely been validated by third party. And uh, okay, Spirit of Home. What does it say on here? It says this is for the non-conformist, right? Okay, the outsider, anyone who doesn't want to fit in. This looks like a pretty good uh, way to stand out in a crowd, I'll tell you that. Inspired by the Highlands landscape, which um, the Highlands actually, I think the largest area in Scotland. And uh, if people don't think about the TV show, they're uh, definitely uh, would think maybe Glen Morangi. They're, they're uh, from that same area. We may need a weapon to open this. Tell you what, they sealed this pretty good. Got it off here, all right. So um, this was pretty expensive, I'll be honest with you. It's 80 euros overseas. Uh, it cost us about 120 bucks over at the ABC Liquors. So you'll be able to find it in Total Wine too as well. You know, I, I totally understand why this stuff is expensive. Time is money. Nine to 20 year old single malt, 20 year whiskeys that are blended. It's expensive. This stuff's gotta be stored somewhere. And there's all sorts of things that have to be considered. So I get it and I'm enjoying this. If anything, they may have put the gold medals in here, right? So it was, uh, it was not a cheap bottle. It's a blended Scotch whiskey, single malt, oh, nine to 20 year old malts. Mmm. Wow. And I, I'm not really a Scotch drinker per se, but this has a, a kind of a sweet smell to it. That's why I got the Norland glass. If you haven't ordered one of these yet, please use our link below. Changes the game. 
I don't think this needs it. Actually, it does need it. This is gonna bring out the best in the best. You know, and Sam has his own whiskey glasses too. They're doing tequila now. Guy's made a really big splash. That's what success will do. You get a little good at something, you start adding to your portfolio and you continue trucking home. Oh, well, we love it. All right, well, let's, uh, let's get a little in here. Look at that, such a vibrant gold color. You can see it on the, on the rim of the glass there. Swirl. Again, it has like a perfumey, very light, I don't know if maybe perfume flowery scent to it. Almost maybe like butterscotch. It's actually a very creamy finish. It's warm, like I could definitely feel it, the alcohol for sure. Uh, I think this is 92 proof. Let's double check here. Yeah, 46% alcohol. So some of the burns coming from there. Now, now smelling it and tasting it for the second time. It starts sweet and then it definitely gets down the business. Nutmeg, cinnamon, pepper, slight burn, slight peppery burn, but you get the vanilla and the oak, right? It's just aged in oak for at least three years. That's one of the sco uh, scotch rules. That's where this color comes from. So not mixing, um, well, maybe we will make a cocktail, but not today. I understand why they won the awards. I would definitely buy this bottle or, or sip it for special occasions. In the, the Gaelic language, whiskey means water of life, or you know, roughly translated to. So I get it. And the, the first distillation in Scotland was like 1494. So got a little experience, not as much as those German beer makers, I'll tell you that. But this is a damn good product. I am happy I tried this. This is, let me put the glass down. This is two thumbs up. Definitely enjoyed it. This is meant to be savored with friends or uh, drank alone. If you're gonna be an outsider and stand out, you're gonna be a stranger, don't invite anybody. Buzz with your cuz on your own. If you're of legal drinking age in your local municipality, never drink and drive own this bottle on your own and uh, share it if you want. I think it's definitely, this is a high-end product, no doubt. This is not something you'll find at your local bar unless they specialize in, in whiskeys and scotches and know what they're doing. So I am going to finish this up and finish this video by telling you that you forgot to comment and you didn't subscribe to the channel and you didn't hit thumbs up, but you're still here, so we love you anyway. Make sure that you hit that alarm bell notification so you know what's happening. You're gonna wanna see next week. May not top this, you're gonna have to tune in, find out. Special thanks to Andrew Simple Cooking. Check out his channel. Really a great catalog of videos to go back and, and look at. Simple Cooking. Outstanding products, great videos, great people. Give them the thumbs up. Subscribe to them too. Subscribe to everyone. That's your job. And that is your buzz with your cuz. Here's looking at you, Sam. Loved it.